high tech has brought about unprecedented civilization for mankind, while also serving as the root of all kinds of catastrophe in the world. Standing in this global graveyard of dumped electronic waste, with a view of electronic waste entering our eyes, the air is filled with an odor of burnt plastic. Rivers choked with pitch black water flow slowly towards the sea. Are we really going to allow dated 19th century technology to treat toxic 21st century high-tech waste products? And allow these toxins to seriously contaminate our waters and cause detriment to our health? Along with the mission of recycling, protecting the earth, and in coordination with the development of high-tech products, Super Dragon Technology Company Limited was established in 1996. It inherited a decade's worth of experience from Changpu Industrial Company Limited and experienced years of technological research and development. Super Dragon Technology re-recycles products by making use of high-tech and equipment in the biggest, most profound electronics waste resource treatment plant in Taiwan, located in the Guanyin Industrial Area. When the high-tech industry is busy improving our lives and entering the front lines of the world, Super Dragon offers support through love. It is determined not to let hazardous waste destroy our homes and environment and endanger our health. It helps us truly guard our planet. Super Dragon has in the past 20 to 30 years taken care of the environment and recycling. But we still see the Earth's resources getting damaged. This has become a burden for Mother Earth. Let's love our Earth together. Recycling is an industry and a career. It combines strategic partners, talents, techniques, markets, and the environment. Super Dragon employs a professional, vertically integrated plan to provide the customer with all-in-one, one-step service. To proceed with resource treatment of high-tech waste products, Super Dragon makes use of the German automatic closed grinding method this prevents possible secondary contamination that may occur from burning or burial. It also has dust collection equipment and wastewater treatment plants in order to maintain a clean environment. Super Dragon combined precious metal refining techniques developed by ETRI, Industrial Technology Research Institute, and provides its clients with the optimum service planning for precious metals in order to achieve reuse of recycled materials and create a win-win situation. It plans to improve in all strategic areas pertaining to precious metal recycling in the future. Super Dragon also established an electronics material department, which has developed a form of vacuum sputtering target. This vacuum sputtering target is now widely used in numerous semiconductor and optical companies in Taiwan. The Electronics Material Department continues to develop highly sophisticated hybridized metal targets. In addition, Super Dragon managed to successfully manufacture PGC entirely on its own. The quality is on a par with Switzerland and Japan. Diversified services are always the goal of Super Dragon. We therefore have established semiconductor and optical process component waste metal recycling and rinsing technique teams and provide clients with a total solution, from rinsing to the recycling process, waste and tear of precious metals. Effectively reducing customer costs has always been our goal. Dedicated to recycling for more than 20 years, Super Dragon not only promoted heavily the concept of recycling, but gave birth to the Green Products Fair, which employs advanced devices to create all kinds of artistic ornaments, construction materials, and landscaping materials from recycled products. These can become part of our everyday lives and remind us to take better care of the environment. The Super Dragon team is developing drain covers the reason I developed the drain covers is because I noticed that in Taiwan they're constantly being stolen. 
After development, I gave some to several remote villages in Taiwan. It's been almost three years now. The drain covers are still in good shape. I believe that developing drain covers that can be used again and again has definitely been a good thing for Super Dragon. The Dragon Baby, with its colors of green and blue, represents the defense of resources and protection of the Earth. We hereby uphold the mission of protecting our environment and will continue to devote our efforts to beloved Mother Earth into the distant future. Turning garbage into gold is not a dream, but a reality. Super Dragon is a leader in metal refining. Whether in terms of capital, devices, investments, or techniques, Super Dragon is way ahead of its competitors. It specializes in refining IT waste products into high purity gold. This not only reduces waste of the Earth's resources, but also creates a lot of profits for the company and participating clients. Compared to the high transportation costs of normal offshore processing or the environmental damage that happens between operations and the possible ruin of a country's image, Super Dragon makes use of a very consistent treatment process. There are currently more than 200 institutions that rely on Super Dragon for waste treatment. Super Dragon has accumulated many years of experience in the waste computer recycling process. It has also received the honor of visitation by important foreign guests and was thus appointed by the Environmental Protection Department as an important factory to visit. Super Dragon, through its innovation, performance and services, has continuously enhanced waste product treatment experiences and technology using the whole plant output method to promote them worldwide. Currently, Super Dragon has not only established plants in mainland China, but also aggressively established the third plant in Taiwan. This serves as a base to enter the world market and because of this, Super Dragon has even signed a partnership contract with Kojima Chemicals in Japan. The third plant will take green architecture as its design principle. It is going to have a park-like plan and will be a world-class green model recycling plant. It will also make use of its strength since it's close to the harbor so that it can invite more people to enter the bandwagon of protecting the environment.